Hello, 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 everybody. This is the Strength, Courage, and Wisdom channel, and we're coming to you tonight with Bat Black Excellence in 12 Minutes or Less. Tonight's spotlight is on sanitary belts and lawnmowers. Mary Beatrice Davidson Kenner was born in 1912 in North Carolina. She came from a family of inventors. Her father was an inventor of a clothing press, which he did receive a patent for. Her sister Mildred invented war games, which she too received a patent for. But Mrs. Kenner's claim to fame that brought her name recognition to this day, the three of five inventions that she won patents for, the sanitary belt, a toilet paper holder, and an in-shower backwasher. It's important to note that Mrs. Kenner's inventions weren't recognized because of racism and money. It's very expensive to file a patent. So when Mrs. Kenner shopped her inventions to prospective buyers in 1956, they lost interest because she was black. Her innovation of the sanitary belt is important because back in the day, women did not have the convenience of disposable sanitary napkins. So women used a variety of measures, hence the term we used to use back in the day on the rag. The sanitary belt held the pad securely in place. Unfortunately, she was unable to pay for her patent until 1957. After that, she invented a toilet paper holder. And what made this toilet paper holder unique is how it holds the fabric securely in place. Ingenuous for a household with toddlers. She didn't patent this one to nearly 30 years later in 1982. She also invented a mounted back washer for the shower. Mary Kenner never made the fortune she deserved, but her friends at SCW Films know she could have made it there had she had a level playing field. Next up, born to former slaves, John Albert Burr was born in 1848, which would have made him a teenager during the Civil War. There's not much known about Mr. Burr, but his phenomenal improvement on the rotary blade lawnmower patented in 1899 at the age of 51. His patent reads, the object of my inventions is to provide a casing which wholly encloses the operating gear so as to prevent it from becoming choked by the grass or clogged by obstructions of any kind. It is also easier to get in hard to reach areas. Over the course of his life, he patented 30 inventions, mostly relevant to agriculture and landscaping care. Unlike most inventors, Mr. Burr partook in royalties. He died in 1926 of influenza. So when you see a fussy old man pushing rotary more, always remember John Burr made the necessary improvements. So that'll wrap up this edition of Black Excellence in 12 Minutes or Less. You are watching the Strength, Courage, and Wisdom channel. Don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and share. Good night. God bless.